Displaced workers of the Philippine offshore gaming operators, or POGO, are in crisis as the operation gets banned by President Ferdinand Marcos Jr. Although only few POGO's workers are Filipinos, most foreigner workers are also vulnerable while they are just victims of human trafficking. With this, the Department of Social Welfare and Development, or DSWD, vows to help both Filipino and foreign workers of POGO. DSWD Secretary Rex Gachalian says displaced foreign POGO workers will be provided with temporary shelters while the Philippine government coordinates with their respective embassies for their safe return to their country. While affected Filipino POGO workers will be aided with corresponding basic necessities and livelihood. The loss of livelihood is a crisis. It's defined as a crisis. So, meron tayong immediate intervention dyan na social welfare. Ibig sabihin, ayuda ka agad kasi alam naman natin na mawawala. Ayaw natin na mawala ang pagkain nila sa mesa, sa hapag. So, immediately, ayuda muna. Secretary Gatchelan adds that they are converting Pogo facilities to shelters of street dwellers. The agency only needs a little re retrofitting of the facilities to make it child-friendly for street children.